carrying placards with various inscriptions, the enraged and graduates proceeded to the administrative unit of the school for an explanation. However, the peaceful protest turned violent as the dam and bank domiciled on the campus and the Senate building as well as the Information and Computer Technology Center of the school were reportedly attacked by the rampaging students. One of the students who wouldn't disclose her identity said quality and affordable education is a right, not a privilege. The unprecedented increment of fees in photo has brought an untold hardship on the students and raised eyebrows. Therefore, the students have taken it upon themselves to protest the imposition, with no confidence at all in the apex student body. On arrival, the operatives of the State Police Command cordoned off the campus, making frantic efforts to restore normalcy, even as they made some arrests. The police public relations officer in the state, Andrew Nguyen, told a correspondent in a telephone conversation that the police had restored normalcy on the campus. The police spokesperson who said that no arrest had yet been made as at the time this report was filed said that the police had to move in when the protests turned violent. That even everything in school now were paying for it, like the cost of registration. It, like my elder one, he was telling me he registered some courses for one eight and now we're listening for four thousand. Make it make it the compulsory women for all you want. What about people who don't have the money for it? Experience anything like Wi Fi, free Wi Fi, there's nothing and even if you see it's locked. And if you go and lay your complaints, they'll tell you we are still working on it. I mean, for how long? Like me, I paid my school fees since last year. And up till now, I'm still waiting for the Wi-Fi, which I have not seen. Increment of school fees. Should I want them to start breaking and, you know, looting everywhere? Meantime, the management of the institution has announced the immediate closure of all activities on the campus. A statement issued by the school's registrar, Uju Unabuihi, shortly after normalcy was restored, ordered the students to proceed on a mid-semester break. The statement, which was silent on the allegations of the increment in fees and the quantum of destruction by the enraged students, stated that the directive was with measured effect.